The House of Representatives has criticised the unavailability of functional scanners at the various ports nationwide. The House found out this is posing a great revenue loss and also promoting corruption among customs personnel. The motion, which was sponsored by Honourable Nicholas Osai from Delta State, urged lawmakers to ensure proper scanners are installed at the various ports to increase efficiency in ports operations. There's no place in the world today that you don't have scanning machines. The most annoying thing is that we visited the ports the other day. And if, I can, if, if you see it, the loss of revenue Nigerians are losing in the port today, it will be amazing. Yesterday, somebody, uh, the Honorable Speaker, most knowledgeable speaker, asked me a question. How can we generate revenues to fund our, our budget? That is the real way to, to fund our budget. Because when you facilitate the business of the port, you generate more revenue. Custom will be praised for generating more revenue. That is another aspect to fund our budget. When you have a problem, you look for solution. Now, we are talking about bringing arms, illegal arms, to the country. This will solve the problem, apart from generating revenue for the nation. So it is important, if we want to move forward as a country, it is important we sit down and do all those things right. If we don't do it, we can't move forward. If you reduce discretion, you reduce corruption to a very, very minimal level. When you allow custom officials to begin to eye mark containers, that's too much discretion given to individuals. But with scanners, there's not much discretion there. I mean, you can, whatever you do is recorded, it's computerized.